So you see, they succeeded. Now you know better. Don't let them do this again. And for all my brides, I say to you, when you hit some kind of irreconcilable issue that begins to draw all your attention to itself, you may very well assume that the enemy has deliberately done this to throw you off. One indicator is that you were doing just fine before. Everything was going smoothly and your faith was in place and you were at peace. Then all of a sudden you begin to have doubts, serious doubts, that take you away from the matters at hand. You begin to obsess over them and come to a completely confused standstill. That is demonic. You struggle not against flesh and blood, but spirits of the air, lying spirits sent to confuse and cast out, to erode faith and cause you to stumble. But I said the binding prayer. Aren't they included in that? Remember when you came back to prayer after a break? I nudged you to say it again. Oh. And you didn't. Bingo. But even beyond prayers, my beloveds, even beyond that, if you come up against something that seems unresolvable at the moment, don't allow yourself to be locked into a struggle with it. This is most definitely a temptation meant to derail you. So now you are free, my dear one. Move on. There is so much for you to do. I give you all my blessing and grace now that you will be resolute in waiting for me. Add to that a careful examination of dynamics that might frustrate or hinder your faith. Be on guard against those who would derail your patient endurance, and in all things continue in the hope I am imparting to you this night. I love you all dearly. The table is set. The food is prepared. Soon we will be seated at the banquet together. Soon.